Okay, he missed us. Ah, shit, he hit us that time. Alright, he's dead. Uh, this isn't good. This one's gonna be close, you guys. I th think we're gonna survive. Oh, man, this is close. Oh! To Icarus, I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, uh, we hopefully can yes, to get started upgrading to stone. And we are going to upgrade our starter house to stone, so I don't have to keep repairing it. Uh, right before I started this recording, we had another big storm come through. And so, yeah, um, I have another talent point and some tech tree points. Let's just continue pumping out solo uh, for the moment. So, let's see, this increases wood, stone, or fiber yield. Molt, Stonewood, uh, uh, yeah, we already did that. Okay, so I think, yeah, this would be the next one. Unless, what's this, though? All buildables weigh less in your inventory. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, well, let's go with the big three uh, for this one, and then we'll we'll worry about the rest of those later. Uh, eventually, we're going to get into these other ones, too, of course. Okay, so for Tech Tree, um, so it looks like I do have a building upgrade tool. I kind of wanted to poison paste I kind of wanted to get the iron hammer. Um, we could do the crossbow now, too. Hmm. That's tempting. I like crossbows. Uh, but let's focus on stone here. Okay, so we're going to want um, stone frame. A heavy stone foundation. Okay. And we're going to need stone beam in order to get to stone walls. So if we go... Yeah, that one, and then this one, and this one. And that's all we can do. So we're going to have to wait till the next level. Because we need stone wall and stone roof in particular. But we can at least get the foundation and pillars and all that updated right now okay cool um so to do that i assume we have to make the stone pieces and then have them in our inventory Ooh, that's going to require leather and iron nails too my goodness that's kind of expensive okay um let's go uh, as you can see i made two cabinets this has like tools and equipment and so forth in it and this one has raw resources um, so let's grab a stack of leather out of here and we'll stick this in here and then, um, does this, yeah, that just requires straight up stone. Okay. And let's put this wood in here too. Yeah, that stuff's kind of expensive. Uh, all right. I got a whole bunch of iron ingots in here. So why don't we take the full stack out? And then make the maximum number of iron nails that we can. I think that's going to be, yeah, that should be 530. And that'll probably hold us in good stead for a while. Oh, did I not move that other ingot out? Yeah, here. Um... Yeah, let's let's reduce this down till it turns red. There. Okay. That way it doesn't use these up. All right. Now the next thing we want to do is we want to get uh, some stone in here. Uh, so I have been you know busy farming, and oh, our O2 is low. So let's take a hit of this. Uh, farming, you know, wooden stone. And, but, you know, gone out, done a little bit of hunting and exploring near the base. Haven't gone real far. I did find another, a new cave location, uh, which is, oh, I guess the game doesn't remember your, uh, your marks when you log out, because I had to log out since then. But I think somewhere right up in here, I found another cave. So we'll go up there and look for it, because uh, I've mined out uh, the one cave already. Anyway, uh, let's grab some stone here. Uh, we'll grab that much to start with. 
Oh, yeah, put that in here. All right. So now we just need the nails. So let's grab... We'll keep some nails in here. Oh, that's a lot of nails. Just... That's... <laughs> Jeez Louise. Okay, yeah, we made quite a few. <clears throat> um. Okay, so we, we have... Uh, nine foundations, right? Yeah, okay. So let's make... How many of those can we make? Only seven. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, all right. Well, let's make seven. We'll start with that. And <clears throat> we might... We're probably going to need some more wood. I think we'll probably have enough nails for now. Or maybe we don't. I don't know. So let's just grab some more wood. We'll use up everything I've stockpiled here to get as much upgraded as we can. Oh, uh, shift plus control actually transfers all of the same type. Okay. So, um, how many did we make? Seven, so we need two more, which means we need more stone. Okay. Let's just grab all the rest of the stone, because that's what it's there for. A little bit heavy. So you guys told me in the comments that I'm not actually going to get any pay for this mission. Which kind of sucks, I guess, but that's alright. Uh, this mission is <clears throat> important because we're learning the game and we're having fun doing it, which is, of course... Oh no, that's not what I want to do. I only want to make two more. Okay. Uh, which, of course, is very important, too. Um, so, yeah. So when I upgrade these foundations, does that mean I need to... Um, also upgrade the poles. We'll have to see what that, what that does. Actually, though, these aren't even foundations at all. These are ceilings, aren't they? Hmm. Well, let's just see what it does. Okay, so we need to make an upgrade hammer, and we're going to have to just use the, the wooden version for now. Uh, so we need fiber sticks and stones for that. Okay, so fiber sticks and stone... Okay, so let's make the building upgrade tool. We'll eventually, you know, get the iron version of these, but this is what we need to use for the time being. All right, so let's go here. And do we just hit it? How do we upgrade? Oh, no. Does this not work because it's not a foundation? Oh, no. I think I might have just wasted a whole shitload of those. Here, let's try it with uh, one pillar. Okay, I must be doing something wrong. I'm using the building upgrade tool, but when I left click or right click, it doesn't do anything. So, improve your structures without tearing them down. It allows you to replace an existing structural piece for an advanced version. If you have that item in your inventory, hold R. Oh, hold R when holding the tool. Oh, okay, okay. So, uh, stone. Oh, there we go. Okay. So, can we, can we do it here, uh, too? No, because this is a ceiling. All right. Well, you know what we could probably do is tear the ceiling, take the ceiling up, and then just put the wood uh, stone foundation in its place. Um, concrete, aluminum, glass, wood, interior wood. Cool. Okay, so... Um, I guess that means we have to destroy these then, right? I really find it hard to believe that there's no way to destroy something without having to actually bang on it. Is it because I need the repair hammer, maybe? Let's go 
to nine. Pressing R doesn't do anything. Right click doesn't do anything. Left click just hits it. Huh. Okay. Um, well, I guess we have to break it. Okay. Let's put this in slot number nine and... Uh-oh. Is it not going to snap? Uh-uh. Uh, it... There it goes. It just snap there. Okay. Um. Yeah. All right. Well, we got our wood, uh, our stone foundation in. I guess um, I'm gonna be banging on stuff for a bit. I wonder if I have to pick this stuff up and move it. Here, let's test that uh, with the floor torch. Because if we lose the floor torch, it's not a big deal. Yep, we lost the floor torch. Uh, oh, no, we didn't. We got it back. It just fell as a thing. Okay. All right, let's put this in here. We just got to get it to snap like that. Nice. Okay, cool. Now, let's put the uh, torch back in place so we have that little bit of light there. Just kind of right in the center-ish of this. And then we'll put the sticks back in and light her back up so we can see what we're doing. Awesome. All right, guys. Um, I made a mistake. And so I thought, well, okay, I break this with my, you know, with my pick. So I started whacking on my pick and it didn't take any of the durability down. And then I'm going, what the hell? So I finally decided to look up how to, to remove a block, and it's the Y key. <laughs> and if you guys have told me this in the comments already, uh, it's just because I've pre-recorded a lot of these episodes and I haven't seen that. And once I, <clears throat> excuse me, once I looked that up, I remembered from the multiplayer that I was told that too, but I just completely forgot that that's how it works. So yeah, it's the Y key. So there we go. Man, I just could have saved myself a hell of a lot of time. Uh, had I known that, but, you know, uh, on the plus side, I did get some more XP for breaking up the floors by hand, so there you go. Uh, and it looks like I got the foundation back, too, which is even better. Um, so, now it's snapped in place. Okay, so I'm going to move all this stuff back um, where it was, and then uh, we're going to we're gonna make a couple crafting stations. So, I'll see you after I get everything moved back here. We are back, and uh, so we got the floor all in... Uh, I don't actually need to do the pillars because we have foundations in. So, yeah, there should be no reason to have to do those. Um, in fact, we could even just pick those back up with Y <laughs> and just hang on to them. We might be able to use them uh, later. So, let's get that. So cool that we get this stuff back. Oh, shit. That's not what I meant to do. Okay. To really make sure we're hanging on to those uh, or pointing at the pillars and not this stuff. Thank goodness we don't lose any of this though. Uh, that would be a very sad, sad state of affairs, wouldn't it? Uh, okay, so let's put this back here just temporarily and stick all this stuff with shift click back in place. Get this guy back down. Um, niner, 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 and have it snap. And then we can put this back here. I might actually move this over a little closer to the anvil too, just because we have more crafting stations to fit in our little shack here. Okay, take all of that. Okay, now... Let's make sure we're looking right at the pillar. You know how we could tell, actually, if we get the building hammer, it'll tell us that that's what we're doing. Uh, repair hammer. That way we know for sure that's what we're looking at. Okay, now we can press Y. And again, I'll just store these and we might uh, end up reusing them. 
for the main build, at least to get started with it. We'll see how that goes. I realized, too, when I was looking in the masonry bench that I could have actually made stone ceilings instead, but um, I'm, I'm okay with the fact that we used foundation, so it's good. It's all good. A little more work maybe for us, but we got got the job done. Uh, all right. There. And can we get to this other one without getting stuck? There. All right. So we got s some of those materials back. Let's take a drink while we're here. And we'll put all of this in here for now. Uh, no. Not in there, in here. This is our equipment tools, and this these are raw resources in here. I always want to look on the left. I always think the right's my inventory and the left is a container, because I think it's that way in a lot of other survival games. But sometimes I put the wrong thing in the wrong place. Okay, good. Well, let's see what else we can make now. So we learned a couple more things, like the mortar and pestle, and we didn't make that. So what's this? The crafting bench, the oxidizer. I think we're going to have to make that stuff in here, maybe? Yeah, here we go. Okay, so we need silica ore and stone. Silica ore should be in here. And we have lots of stone in here. So let's make that. And then uh, we also have the skinning bench and the cooking station to make. And the fireplace. Okay, so we can make the skinning bench now. Let's make that. And then uh, the cooking station requires four iron ingots. The fireplace requires more stone. Okay, so let's grab some stone and some iron ingots out of here. Oh. Do we not have any iron ingots at all? Oh my goodness. Did I use up all of my iron ingots? I thought we saved a stack of those. Damn it, we didn't. Well, that's not good. Uh, okay, so let's grab this in the mortar and pestle. Uh, let's make the fireplace. And this is supposed to be like a cooking thing, so I guess it can replace the fire pit. Or maybe... Well, let's see how big it is, first of all. Uh, so we'll put that in slot 8. Oh, well, it's pretty good size. Oh, uh, must snap. Uh-oh. What are we missing here? Okay, here. Let's go. What the hell, man? Alright, let's go back into here for a second. Fireplace. It doesn't say anything. Let's go to the tech tree. Uh, it doesn't say anything about having to be on a specific type of surface. Oh, maybe, you know what? Maybe we do have to build the chimney for this to work. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. Well, here, let's go ahead and hop into here. How are we doing on our food, by the way? Yeah, we could stand to eat. Let's eat a carrot, some meat, and some berries. Let's move, or, or let's just pick this up for now and put it in here. And I'm going to put, uh, actually, I think we put the charcoal in the mortar and pestle. Can we put that up on top of a table? That would be kind of cool. Oh, we can. Look at that. All right. We're going to put that on top of the crafting bench for now. We might move it somewhere else later. So we just have to look down here for crafting and here for mortar and pestle. All right. 
organic resin is wood and oxide and tree sap from sticks. Okay, let's um let's grab some sticks. And put those in there. And we'll whoop up some tree sap because we can. So we're gonna need it for something. And this is oxide and wood. Uh, do I have any oxide in here? I don't. Uh, we have quite a bit in here, though. Let's uh, split the stack. Um. Okay. And we'll put this in here. And it said it wanted wood, too. So let's put that wood in there. And we'll make some organic resin because we can. Let's get a little XP, too. Okay, so we got that in place. <clears throat> now, back to this fireplace business. I'm thinking that the reason we can't set this down is because we need a chimney. You'd think it would tell us that, though. So let's... Um, Just making sure it's not, like, wanting to be on the ground, which wouldn't make much sense anyway. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go in back into here. So we got a chimney cap, chimney cap half, and chimney extension. This recipe requires... Oh, yeah, okay, let's get some stone. We're going to have to go do some more farming here pretty soon. Um, okay, so chimney cap half, this requires da, 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 chimney cap, chimney extension. Uh, probably, a, here, let's make the cap first and just see how big it is. Okay. So... Must snap. All right, I'm missing something, obviously. Okay, hold on, hold on a second. I, I'm going to look this up because I don't want to waste a ton of my time or your time trying to figure this out. Be right back. Okay, so according to what I was reading, it doesn't snap to a foundation. It has to snap to a floor. Um, okay, so I guess that means we have to make a stone floor. So let's do that. Seems kind of odd. Uh, but that's what I was reading, so... Okay, so let's put that in slot 8... And is that going to look all jank when we do this? No, I guess not. There we go. All right. Can we... We can't uh, do kitty corner, huh? Okay. Well, I think I want it to go this way then. Very nice. Weird, but nice. Okay. So now can we put the chimney cap uh, on here, I'm assuming. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Okay. Yeah, so it has to be on a floor piece. It can't go right on a foundation. Um, so there you go. Okay, let's um, let's put some wood back in here. I'm saving my coal for the smelter. I don't know why. It probably doesn't matter, but and light her up. And then we'll just, since we don't have any kind of a refrigerator or anything, we'll just continue to store our food in there. That's neat, though. It looks really cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Does smoke coming out the chimney? Oh, man, there's no smoke coming out the chimney. That sucks. How 
How did that not hit him in the head? Or maybe it did. Maybe it doesn't do the cinematic all the time. I think it does, though. I mean, it seems like every time I've ever hit something in the head, it does the cinematic. Um, oh, we got some downed trees from the storm. A lot of downed trees. All right, I'm going to actually cut these up because I think they'll probably disappear. So let me do that real quick. Well, crap, we got another storm coming in. Now it's going to be a lightning storm. <sighs> the game's going to fight its tooth and nail until we get this place upgraded to stone, isn't it? Um, and my goodness, it knocked down a bunch of trees. Oh, shit. Get inside quick. Uh, we got to get our, our whacker thing ready. Well, I guess it is ready. Um, I'm just going to put all the wood in here for now. But look at all that wood I cut, you guys. <laughs> just from the freaking... Uh, what the storm knocked over. All right, we'll put that in there. This can go in here. Uh, we got the skinning bench, so let's set that down. Um, probably, how big is it? Pretty good size. I'd kind of like to actually put that um, by the fireplace. So I think what we're going to do is move this over here. Oh, man. This is, like, freaking me out. Okay, we better pay attention. I'll move that stuff later. <laughs> we better pay attention here. Get ready with the whacker. The worst of it's coming up here with the little red in the gauge in the upper right-hand corner. But, yeah, what we'll do is we'll move this over to here, and we'll put the oxide dissolver over here. Hopefully this is the last time we have to deal with this bullshit, because uh, we are... Eh, we're all about two-thirds of the way to the next level. Then we're going to get w stone ceilings and walls, and then we can upgrade this whole place to stone, and then we don't got to worry about it. All right, there we go. Let's start whacking. We are hitting that, right? Yeah. Okay, and then we got our stone hammer. Or not our stone hammer, our repair hammer, rather. Handy to fix it all up. Guess we gotta hit it twice to get rid of the, the burned look. Okay. Thank goodness they... Oh man, we just fixed that. They decided to uh, come up with the idea of the fire whacker. Otherwise you'd be screwed, man. <laughs> oh, did you see that make my temperature go up? Oh, interesting. Okay, it looks like we're through the lightning part of it. So let's just get a little stand back and we'll repair this twice. And same thing here. Whew. Okay. Wow. Uh, all right, let's get this uh, moved over here. So hold X to pick up. And then we will put it down here. And we'll just set it. I might actually be making more cabinets later. So why don't we put the... Uh, actually, yeah, why don't we put it right here? This is good, a good place, I think, for it. That way, if we need a hit of O2 in the middle of the night, we can just get up and grab it right by the bedside. Okay. Put that stuff back in there. Uh, we might as well put that in, too. And now... Um, this is kind of long. Let's just see how it fits. So I guess what we do in this case is we take the carcass, and we bring it to the table, and then harvest it here, and then we get more resources. Okay. That's kind of neat. Uh, all right. Let me go see if... Are the, wait a minute, are, have some of these trees started to grow back, or is this just my imagination? I don't know. Maybe maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, anyway, I've got a few more trees out here that I want to cut. Um, 
or wood. It's kind of free wood. It's free wood in the sense that we didn't ever cut the tree down. I guess not that that's a big deal, but it's down, so I don't want it to go to waste, you know. Okay, any more downed trees? I think that's probably about it. Okay. Yeah, I guess maybe just that side hasn't gotten hit. Alrighty then. So, um, let's take a look at... Is there anything else we can make? Oh, the cooking station. Oh, but we can't because we need iron. Alright, I'll tell you what. Let's go out, do a little bit of hunting, bring a carcass back, put it on here and see what that's all about. And I want to go find that cave too uh, that I had found earlier. And, um, you know, get some iron. So let's get our tools repaired here. Uh, I guess we don't have to put it in there, right? We just have to be... Oh, we don't have any iron ingots. Son of a bitch. Okay. Um, just in case we need an axe for something and this one breaks, I'm going to bring my stone axe with me. Uh, and yeah, let's just put that wood in there for now. And the silica ore. What did we have that for? I don't remember. Oh, I think we needed it to make the mortar and pestle, maybe. Uh, let's just stick that in there for now. Okay, what time is it? It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, that's, if we if we hurry, we should be okay. Uh, let's grab our other O2 ladder. And we'll also fill up on water. So, let's see. North. The cave that I found was to the north. There's some more trees that are downed. So do those trees stay in my game? The downed trees stay in my game until I log out? Is that how that works? I don't know. What the hell is that? That's just a wolf, right? Oh yeah, it's just a wolf. He's got quite a... Quite a growl on him. Uh, where did he go? Man, it's so hard to see. Didn't we kill him? Oh, here he is. Okay. So let's carry him. And we're going to take him back to the skinning table. His buddies might be coming for him. And I just want to see how that works. So what I understand, like I said, is we get more materials this way. Nothing like swimming in the water while you're... Holding a wolf on your back and getting bit by a poisonous pea runner at the same time. That's such bullshit. Piranha's <laughs> poisonous. Who ever heard of such a thing, man? Okay, so, um, pressed place. Okay, and then I guess we go into the station. And. Or. Oh, Oh, select a red. Oh, okay. I got you. So we would get three meat, 30 fur, uh, leather, 20 fur, and 20 bone. Three, 30, 20, 20. Okay. Just for science, what do we get if we just do this? Twenty six, ten. Yeah. Okay. So it looks like we get maybe thirty percent more or so when we do it on the table. Okay. Now we know for next time. I just wanted to see what you know, how much of a difference it actually made. Uh, okay. So we'll put that in there. Um, I'm just kind of keeping the leather in here for now because we need it for stone stuff. And uh, I guess we could put the bones and the hide in there. Excellent. So we've tried out the skinning table. Now, let's go see if we can find that mine. Uh, 
to the north. To the north, to the north, to the north. What exactly does this do to us? It slowly drains health and ten less ten movement speed. Oh, that kind of sucks. Okay, here, let's grab these berries. Uh, in fact, if we eat them, we should get our third buff. Yes, we got it. Okay. And that gives us more stamina. Uh, no, we need to go north. Okay, go up this way. Let me look at the map here. Come on, map. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, so I think, yeah, I think we, it was somewhere up in here, if I remember right. Let's just go right past our pod. Hi, dear. I'm not going to grab any deer right now because, or anything else, hunting-wise, because I want some, enough room to bring back some iron. I think it's right here, yeah. Okay, so this cave actually has... I don't know, it seems a little, a little jank. Uh, minor showers, okay. Uh, but we actually have to break through to get inside this one, which is interesting. Okay. So we are now in the cave. I'm sure we're going to run into worms. Yeah, there's one there. Uh, I can't... Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, let's just go in and knife him because I can't see him from here. Alright, we got another one. Let's get back here. What does this do to us? Ah, uh, it's just a, a little bit stronger poison than... Uh, you know, than the p Ronis, except for it does stack, so... Yeah, we're, and our health's not that great. Damn it. Okay, let's wait for our health to come back a little bit. We'll eat some more berries. That might help a little bit. And let's take a hit of O2 as well. Okay, let's um, move in again. Just need to see where he's at so I can take him out. Okay, there's another one way back there. Let's get back up here. I wonder if I can... Oh, shit! Here, let's see if we can... Did that kill him? Yeah, it did. Okay. I hope I don't die. My health is going down. I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we'll be okay. Ah, okay. Is that it for you assholes? Let's take a drink of water. Actually, you know what? Let's not go back any further for now. Uh, because if we take another hit, we might die. All I need right now is a little bit of iron, which we have... Wait, is that iron or copper? That's titanium. Oh, I don't think we can get that. This is iron, though. Uh, all right, here. Let's run back out for a second and remove the pneumonia business. I did catch that off camera, too, by the way, and it kind of sucks. It basically cuts, like, your stamina in half and your health in half. and Yeah, it's not very fun. Not good stuff. Does this game have, like, a healing, like a medical pack kind of thing? This is for... We probably better get that. The, the deep wounds thing. Anti-poison paste, heat bandage, antibiotic paste, blood thinning paste. What does that do? Provide a fifth... Less 50% physical trauma afflictions on self and 15% health regeneration. Okay, so that would be kind of like antibiotic. 50% bacterial afflictions on self. What's a bacterial affliction? I don't think I've had one of those. This would not be a bad one to get because it's going to give us health regeneration. Well, that one does too, actually, in a parasitic. Um, so we seem to get poisoned 
a lot. They all have 15% health regeneration. Okay. Especially if you're going into the caves. Uh, so maybe that's the one to get. Okay, let's grab this. Oh, shit. Alright, so there's another one. Let's see if we can nail this one with our bow. I just gotta see his little blue face and then we'll get him. Uh, Bo, hello. Okay, he missed us. I pulled out the wrong thing. Ah, shit, he hit us that time. Alright, he's dead. Uh, this isn't good. This one's gonna be close, you guys. I think we're gonna survive. Oh, man, this is close. Oh, Whew. oh that was close. Okay, no more screwing around. Let's just get this iron and GTFO. Whew. All right, that was a little bit of a hairy, scary trip back in the night. But we made it. Okay, let's put uh, the carrots in there. We'll get some barbecued carrots going. And we want to put our iron in here. And get that uh, smelting so we can get some ingots. All right, you guys. I think that is it for this episode. It was a rather exciting episode, <laughs> to say the least. Uh, but we made it. We didn't die. We came close, but we didn't actually die. And um, so I'm going to let you guys go here. And we are really close to the next level. So what's going to happen... I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do on the next level. Because um, I'd like to take it as soon as I get it. Um, but I'm going to go to... I'm assuming we're going to get three points. So for the talents, we're probably going to go... Increase XP gain when not in a party. Increase yields from hunting. This reduces buildable carry weight for pieces. Increase inventory weight capacity. Ooh, yeah, that's a good one. Increase yields from hunting. Okay, so I'm probably going to go with Lone Wolf next, and then probably this Pack Horse. And then maybe I'm, I'll think about these other ones. Um, these I want two I want for sure. These maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, before we start going to the other one. So that'll be the talent uh, that we're going to do for uh, for tech tree. Uh, we're going to take the stone uh, over here. We're going to take stone wall and stone roof so that we can then upgrade our, stone, our wood walls and roofs. And then that's going to leave me one more point. And I think I'm going to actually put that last point in this anti-poison paste. Um, mostly for caving because... You know, the stupid fish aren't that big of a deal, but the cave worms, because they can stack on us, uh, that was significant. It, it almost killed us. Uh, so I think that's what we'll do. Um, and then we'll get these walls upgraded to stone. And um, then we need to get another level before we can really do anything else in terms of building, you know, more crafting stations. Uh, but the idea will be that we'll start thinking about building our main base, which is going to be on the other side of the boulder. Uh, behind our wall because this is just our starter base here all right guys that's it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment and share out the video and we'll catch you in the next episode goodbye